Hi everyone, this is Fred Ranger. I hope you're doing good. I'm testing today my new rig and this is the uh, Rode SmartLink, or sorry, the Rode Link. And this is a wireless system. So I'm wondering how the audio is being picked up right now. I have the receiver on the Fujifilm X-T2. I'm filming in 4K, so also trying that. Uh, but I'm curious to see is the if the audio is actually better uh, than the Smart Lav from Rode. And when I plugged in it, when I plug in into my um, iPhone. So right now I'm plugged in directly in the X-T2 and I'm actually um, putting the input level to one. So that's the minimum level that you can get uh, because on this little device, I'm at plus 10 dB. So I'm, I'm, I think the, the, the pickup uh, uh, will be good because I'm not using the preamp in the X-T2 as much. Uh, as if I was at like 10, 11 in the usual um, levels that I use it. But um, I'm gonna try here setting it to zero just to compare and to see if we have enough gain that goes into the X-T2. So I'm putting it to zero. So as you can see, the sound must be a little bit lower. Uh, is it usable? Maybe, maybe not. I'm gonna see when I'm gonna edit this video. And again, this is just a quick run and gun type of video where I test my new gear uh, and I'm going to try a plus 20 dB so you might want to turn the volume down on your YouTube uh, player because that might actually peak and let's try it that's 20 dB so I'm pretty sure that it's peaking and it's doing all these like red thingy um, but again this is just a, a quick test let's go back to 10 I think I might use it at 10 dB. Now I'm at, I'm at plus 10 dB on the road link. So we'll try it like that. We'll see how it goes. Uh, and maybe I'm, I'm gonna use it at zero or 10. But uh, if you have any feedback or any uh, comments or actually any insights on how to use these little beautiful uh, wireless lav mic, uh, I, I would love to hear about it because I'm totally new to that wireless game. I was using the smart lav plugged into my iPhone if you look at all the vlogs that I'm doing and all the videos I'm, uh, that I'm doing on the, on the YouTube channel. Uh, but I'm really, I'm really excited about this little thing because it'll allow me with the G85 that's coming up in a couple days to be a little bit more um, agile when it comes to producing videos. I'm just gonna hook that up, talk to the camera, always plugged in, and I'll be able to run around and actually not just uh, be attached to a phone, that I then need to sync in the Final Cut software. Now I'll be able to do videos run and gun and just import it in Final Cut and the audio will already be there. So be happy, enjoy life, and enjoy your gear. Cheers. How's the tracking doing on XT2 in the 10 to 24? Can it track my face good? We shall.